Hello, welcome back to our lovely reaction videos here from the London Film Festival in the heart of London. We've got a lot of fans to my right just staring at us. Yeah, because there's no one ever usually here. Yeah, they're, they're not really staring at us, they're just there. Uh, we're going to review, I'm Paul Heath from HollywoodNews.com. I'm Stefan Pate from Hey You Guys. Uh, we're now going to review or give you a slight reaction in some I think review is quite a... Yeah, it's a big, big word. Big that. word, that. Uh, to uh, American Honey, which is the new film from Andrea Arnold, uh, which has screened in so far in Cannes, in Toronto, and now in London. I think it gets its uh, UK premiere here in London. It and it's only out. It's out uh, next Friday. Yeah, it's, it? out very so it's out very soon as well. So I think it premieres over the weekend. We're filming this on a Thursday, our second day of uh, LFF. So 14th, Dave? All right, thank you. Okay. Brilliant. And uh, lost my train of thought. Don't matter. Uh, right, so the film stars Sasha Lane and Shia LaBeouf and loads of other characters. A, a, an ensemble, a huge ensemble. Indeed, I thought. one in which is uh, Elvis Presley's granddaughter. Riley Kioch? Kioch? Kyo? Is that right? No, she's got Presley in her name. No, she hasn't. I'm sure she has. She hasn't. I'm sure she has. Right, this is the one occasion that I'm actually right. He is wrong. Is it not something, something Presley? No. I said it's like a triple Lisa name. Lisa Marie Presley who was married to Michael Jackson. What's her daughter called? Her daughter? Yeah, she's in the movie. Is that her daughter? Yeah, I'm sure it is. No, that's... It doesn't matter. Right. Uh, I'm beat it, mate. Cheers. Yeah, can we just uh, have a clarification on that? We'll check yeah, our phones. Yeah. yeah, we're not in Toronto now where we can't... No. We're um, not paying for... Yeah. So the film is Paul about G. Uh, a young lady, Sasha Lane. She had... I can't remember the name of the character, <laughs> which is awful. Um, was I right? Hang on a minute. What's her name? Hang on a sec. Sorry? Riley Keough, yeah? Was I right? Excuse me, can you pull the camera back? To He's not anything to do with it. Grandchild of Elvis Presley, Riley Keough. I Riley Keough, right? So this paper's wrong, it, you know. You're about to say it again. I'm not going to say I told you, you so. No, that's fine, sorry, I don't matter. Uh, anyway, talk to us about the film, give us the plot. Right, okay, so, um, so yeah, Sasha Lane stars in the leading role, and it's a really great uh, performance. She's playing, we sort of don't we know too much about her, p her sort of past, do we? We kind of meet her, and she's, she seems, she's, she's kind of seems to be with uh, someone who's... Kids. But they're not, yeah, they're not hers. Not her kids, uh, and then she decides that she's had enough. She meets Shia LaBeouf in what is sort of like a, a Kmart, some supermarket. It's like a Walmart. Walmart. I'd say. What's a Kmart? I think Kmart's a smaller shop. Oh yeah, Walmart. Yeah. yeah. Um, and he's singing Rihanna and he's dancing on the yellow diamonds in the sky. There we go. Uh, um, and then the she, he says, "Why don't you come with us and start working with us?" And she's like, "Do you know what? I can't do that." And then no. a day later, she goes, "I can," and then she does. And then she gets in a car and then she starts selling magazines. Uh, with Shia LaBeouf. Not that kind. Um, that kind not know. those kinds. But then her and Shia LaBeouf, they sort of enter into a sort of romantic relationship, but he's sort of going out of Riley Keough. Um, and Presley. Riley Keough, Presley. Yeah. And yeah, it be, the, the thing is, the plot is not what's important here. It's a really visceral, very emotional kind of road movie that it's a real kind of coming of age film in a way, but it's... It's just a film you don't really forget, isn't it? Like there's something about it. It's the way it's shot. It's the atmosphere to it. Mm. So there's a real, the tone of it is quite something. I think Andrea Arnold's done quite a job with this one. Yeah, it's quite a lot. You can actually look at it. There's a lot of little stories put together, little yeah. little segments of life on the road. Good American uh, road movie. Um, I, I didn't actually like. Well, I liked the film. I loved the film. I thought it was a great film. I didn't like any of the characters. I don't think in it. They wound me up from about ten minutes in. And they didn't let off until the end credits roll. That which is, is one of the two problems. Hang on, it's two and three quarter hours later. True. So bear that in mind if you're going to go and see it, because I struggled. But as an overall package, the acting, the direction, the filmmaking, the cinematography, all that stuff, is excellent. So perhaps a film to admire more than like, maybe. Yes. Like is a strong word. But, but I, I do think it's funny because the characters are quite unlikable for the best part I, but I don't think you're supposed to no, get on their side no. so I don't think that's a fault of the filmmaker as such no for that for, for, for that not to be the case because I didn't really like many of them either but I don't think yeah I don't think that's mm. really an issue in this well no. not too much of an issue in this well instance. it's just three hours of your life if you want to you know spend three hours of your life with people, people you don't, you don't like. like it's Christmas day basically isn't it? like every day <laughs> at the festivals uh, it's uh, there's <laughs> no honey in it is there I didn't see any honey. There's no a honey. lot of Americans. Lots though. of Americans. Yeah. No honey. No honey at all. Um, Shia LaBeouf's in there, kind of doing his old method thing. Yeah, mm -hmm. as usual. With a, with a stupid, stupid, stupid air. little stupid air. ponytail thing, little rat tail. It is a rat tail. Awful. I do. I will it. say that Riley Keough is probably the best thing about it, though. In a, you'd think that you know, granddaughter is it granddaughter, yeah, yeah, of Elvis. 
oh, she's got in there because of her name, all that sort of stuff. No, she is actually probably one of the best things about the film. Oh, she's a I really good performance. She's the villain yeah. of the piece. And, and she's a real absolutely awesome. breakthrough for Sasha Lane as well, I think. She's yep. the, the camera just... I sound camera just loves her. Oh. No, no, it really isn't like, because she, she's in almost every single scene and yeah. th- there's barely a shot in the movie that hasn't got her featured in it. And it. you just become so absorbed. By it. And even though, you, like you said, you don't like the character so much, you feel so engaged with the character, I felt. Yeah, which, you know, is a, a tribute to her. You know, she's... Uh, She's fantastic. It almost she does it, did it feel like they were improvising a lot of stuff in it? Yeah, it felt like I, I think yeah. I don't I know if it was or not, but no, but that, that's a good that's a sign of good actors, isn't it? Well, that's Naturalistic, it, which is yeah. one X point. Yeah, yeah. Overall, generally quite but good. Defi- a film that's definitely worth. Even if you don't like it, it's a film you need to see. I think yes. because it's it's one of those films that comes around. You probably get six or seven a year, which are quite special. Even though you don't have to necessarily think it's good, mm. you can still appreciate it's it's doing something. Yeah. Yes. And this film's doing something. Absolutely. Right, that's enough on that. Uh, be sure to check out these videos as the festival rolls on, on hollywoodnews.com primarily. And then if you want to, go on to Hey You Guys. Uh, I'm Paul Heath from the Hollywood News. This is Stefan Pate. Thank you we'll much. see you. Oh, I like <laughs> there. Very soon. Cheeky. See ya. Cheers. <laughs> that's quite a good one, I thought. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys. Is that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey, you guys!